Hi, welcome to Scuba Steve Marketing. I'm Scuba Steve. This week, we are going to talk about backlinks because this month, the whole month of February, we are talking about search engine optimization or SEO. So what is a backlink? You'll find out coming up. Welcome back. Now we're talking about search engine optimization this, this whole month of February of 2016. And this particular week we are talking about backlinks. So I asked the question, what is a backlink exactly? Well, a backlink is basically like a vote for your blog or website. Just like the presidential candidates, they're trying to, to attain and engage where they stand with the people here in America. A backlink is like a vote. Just like they're trying to get votes, backlinks are votes for your blog or website. So they boost your rankings in the search engine. So like Google is going to scan your blog or website and going to determine how many people have actually talked about your site by linking back to your site. So if somebody else is out there, maybe it's the same subject matter that you speak about and they're talking and they're like, yeah, go see Steve's site because he really has something cool to say about whatever it is. And then the keyword that they leave in their blog post and, it, and if you click on that link and it goes back to your site, that is called a backlink. The more backlinks, the higher your rankings, but you can't manipulate this because Google came up with the different names like Panda and like animal names for basically trying to find people that are scamming the system, meaning they're just trying to manipulate the ranking patterns. You want legitimate backlinks, which means you're gonna to have to do some hard work or use a paid service. But I wanna give you four tips on backlinks, okay? how to get more backlinks. Number one, you can do what's called a guest post. I talked about this last week in my blog post. Guest posts are great because you can contact the blog owner, let them know, hey, I got this article that I wanna share and they can review it and all that stuff. And if they, if they so choose to approve your post, your post will be posted with most likely a link back to your site and that does count as a backlink, okay? Um, now, Google changes all the time their algorithm and, and the algorithm is basically just like what they decide to or how they decide to rank websites. By playing by the rules, this is a legitimate way to get more traffic to your site and boost your search engine rankings. You can get closer and closer and closer to the top of Google. Contact a blog or website owner ask if you can do a post, like an article for them. A lot of times you may be surprised, they may actually let you do it and that's going to help you out. Number two, leave comments on other blogs. You have some other blogs out there that are doing similar things or whatever, leave a comment on their post and just give a real legitimate comment on whatever it is that they wrote about because you enjoyed their article. And in that comment, oftentimes, you will find that it is enabled for you to link back to your specific post. And this is important because it does count because Google's gonna scan the site, the site that you left a comment on, and it's gonna find that there's a comment and it links back to your website. Number three, reviews. Reviews are awesome. Just so like you probably see all the time, like how many stars something has like on Amazon or even like Google does this and Facebook does this. But basically reviews that I'm talking about is again, contacting these other blog owners and asking them to review your site, have them give feedback, all that stuff, and then they're gonna write up a whole article about what your blog or website or your blog post is, and that will help because they're basically writing it up themselves and they're reviewing it. It gives them something to do, some content to put out there themselves, and then it also gives you a boost in the search engine rankings because they have a link back to your site. A little segue here, um, it does matter the type of backlink it is. So some, some factors with this is you wanna find blogs or websites that rank a little bit higher than yours and that way that'll give your you know blog or website a little more authority because you're getting something from a page that's ranked higher than yours. You wanna look, wanna check into a page ranker tool I'll leave it in, a, in the description of this video. The page ranker tool will help you know where your page is ranked, where they're ranked, and then how to, again, find the sites out there that are actually ranked a little bit better than yours 
so you can get a little more authority and get some Google love to rank your stuff a little bit higher. All right, number four, you can also do what's called a paid service. And the only thing that I would say about the paid service thing is make sure that they offer legitimate white hat SEO tactics, meaning they are not part of any kind of link farms. There's, there's, no, there's nothing scammy about them and make sure that you check them out. I'm gonna go ahead and recommend one in the description of this video. You can check that out. So please do look at the description. And this is a paid service, so you can actually pay them to find ways to get backlinks to your site. And they probably also do other things like try to give you tips and stuff to make your blog or website a little more search engine friendly. Anyways, that's what they're paid to do, so you might as well check them out. And if you don't have time to do all this stuff, then you can actually pay someone else to do it for you. And this will help a boost to your rankings. SEO, backlinks this week. Next week, we're gonna talk about ranking your site um, locally. And so I'm excited about that because if you are a local business owner, you can learn a little bit more on how to boost your rankings when someone searches locally in your area. As always, please give a thumbs up. Please leave a comment. Please share this video. And legitimately, if you have a question, please, I wanna answer it. Just shoot that comment down below and I will answer to the best of my ability or research it for you. And as always, guys, keep diving into marketing online. We will see you next week. Take care.